your phrase turn the wick up. Paul, when will how can people help? When will they be able to see the movie and and where can people go to to learn all about this? Well, the film itself there's a trail that's been made. It's three minutes. And okay. It's my, my 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 namesake, drpaulporia.com. Okay. Or testofaman.com. Either one will get you to the trailer. Alrighty. And so, in addition, what I what I wanted to do for Ian just as a as a recognition in, in helping me with this is I've retrofitted my actual biker uh, vest because I know he's into vests when he's on stage. I also, yeah. I think you know you've that? got you've got some off-road bikes too, don't you Ian? Don't you do some off-road biking? Well I do, but they're girly bikes, you see. They're, they're not like this big Harley Davidson's or, you To know, go along with the know, flute? Kind of little, little sexy, extremely lightweight trials motorcycle. Okay, well this is a rock and roll vest. or 250cc bikes that, yeah, yeah, I'm, a, I'm a girly biker. <laughs> this is a rock and roll vest he's got you. That's very nice. Wow. You know I've, what? Had, uh, I've had Jethro Tull uh, put onto it as well. That's lovely. And this is my actual vest, so okay. it's been retrofitted to wow. fit you now, so it won't fit me anymore. Oh, wow. <laughs> so it's all yours, my oh, friend. Well, that's nice. fantastic. Oh, that's really nice. <laughs> Paul, we'll take some pictures of, of uh, Ian with that vest on, and we'll put it online, if that's okay with Ian, and we'll put a, a link up to the website. We'll yeah. put a link at shom.com up to the website. Well, and, and I really would love to know the name of your dry cleaners because, as, <laughs> as we know, bikers, they play, they, they wear this stuff and it's called their originals. You know, they yeah. never take it off, never yeah. wash it. And I am now the proud owner of Dr. Paul's biker vest. It's very But cool. I have to say, this smells Smell. incredibly <laughs> fragrant. You must have one hell of a good Chinese laundry for anywhere you live. This is brilliant. Thank you. How hygienic can you get to be a biker? Ian, do you mind if we take a couple of pictures? It's been a pleasure having sure. you. It's really, really a treat. It's how nice of you to come in. Yeah. I was saying last week, a couple of weeks ago, we had Steve Hackett in from Genesis, and I All said, right. as as the the guys in these bands get a little older, they get up a little earlier, which is a benefit <laughs> to us because. I could never get anybody to come well, in and do the morning that, show. Or I just haven't been to bed yet. Okay, well, there, I <laughs> <laughs> never thought of that. But I deeply appreciate it. It's yeah. very, very kind of you to come in. You've got a ton of fans who are yeah. going to be there yeah. tonight. So. Yeah, we're, we're, we're looking forward to this. Really, show. really terrific. Thank and, you. and you've got to see a live prostate exam on stage <laughs> every night on this tour. I do oh, a, yeah? Yeah, about hmm. prostate cancer awareness. I didn't tell wow. you, I've been dating another girl, Dr. Paul. <laughs> <Cheat on me. laughs> Yeah, we do a live prostate exam. Well, stage. what an interesting just, just show that alone it's going to be. And then go and, go and find a nice bar and get it. <laughs> Ian Anderson of You'll Jethro Tull <laughs> and Paul Poirier. We'll put the links up at shom.com. Thank you both. <laughs> Coming up to 8.01. Really? Yeah, really. Wow. Do the, do the, you want to do the...